He goes. All right, this is open it up. That sounds like he's talking to the hooker. Yeah. <laughs> open put, it up. You gotta stretch your bag out first. I have horrible leave the, leave the shaft inside. I'm only yeah. bringing like out the balls. Thumbs. You're only bringing Aww. out the balls. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit. That's just one. Aye, aye, aye. Here it balls. is, fellas. Here we go. All right, wait. Here it is. Here it is. He's gonna pull out his balls. Here it is. He's got gravity. Has been yanking on his balls for decades longer than yours. Look at this. That's just your dick. Hey. I'm going to take that doing? as a win. Where's your balls? You owe me a dollar, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> oh, yeah, I feel, you don't I even have balls. That's sort of weird shame now. <laughs> <laughs> just pulled out the smallest head I've ever oh, seen. Yeah. His is bigger than mine. Yeah. Exactly. Give me a buck. <laughs> Give me a buck. You had a chance to win 100. Not at all, you owe me a dollar, sir. You know what? You can keep that dollar. How about that? <laughs> yeah. Buy, uh, your, buy yourself take, a dick. I'm just going to yeah. take the picture. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else, wow. Ira? That's it. That's all you got yeah. today. Ira. Listen, yeah. before I leave, <laughs> yes, I want to wish Opie and Anthony a happy Easter. Oh. The show is oh wonderful. Thank wonderful. You. Thank, Thank you. you for showing us your cock. Yeah. And listen, yeah. if you oh, want boy. me to <laughs> fill in... A few times, I despise. I will his little do feet. it. I get, like you to fill in a, a cemetery hole. <laughs> <laughs> <A> fucking. <laughs> I despise you. So You're much. the greatest. Oh, You're wonderful. I love yeah. you. Yeah. All right. I love you. <laughs> wow. All right. All right. Thank you, Ira. Right. We got to thank, thank you. Thank uh, you. Thanks for you better, you better not. You've had your fingers on your yeah, That's the yeah, beautiful thing about this show. Yeah. Maybe I, I had to do that to you. Remember the last time I was here, handle. remember when Barry and Barry came in? God, that's that was oh, yeah, right. That was oh, that was awesome. They were yeah. all they were mad that we dragged them in here. We dragged them in. We were talking about him. He came in to defend himself. It was fucking great that day. That was the best. We talked to him about crack and he's like, no one knows what in that pipe. He is the walking reason for anti Semitism, by the way. Ira. Ira. It is just he is he is every stereotype. That is a poster in 1935 Germany. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> I just want to tell you, you do a good job. Listen, <laughs> listen. <laughs> I'm going to proclaim something. Loves the hookers, huh? <laughs> Loves the hookers. Apparently, supposedly, does. we don't even street know. Street hookers. Oh, yeah, he goes yeah, old That's school. old school. Ooh. Where do you even find a street hooker these days? Jim? <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> They're not around that much. You that was, what, what, what's the most shocking thing about Hugh? Gra a buddy of mine ran into a chick that he used to date. She was a street hooker. <laughs> really? Yeah. That would turn oh. me on like a, a life. tough life. Yeah. E Rock, what do you got? Uh, he's walking. I was walking down the hallway, and he does uh, Jay Thomas's show with this other girl, Madison. Right. So he sees her in the hallway, and he goes, "Hey, Madison." She's like, hi, Ira. And he goes, I just showed my balls. <laughs> yeah. He didn't show his balls. Show his balls. Yeah. What, what did he show? He doesn't know what his, his balls are and what his yeah. dick is. No, that was the head of his dick. All right, let's yeah. go to Paul in Pittsburgh. Uh, Paul. I'm not impressed either. <laughs> hey, I want to... Hey, what's going on, boys? Ooh, hi. hi. I want to ask Joe, have you heard of this JWH-018? It's supposed to be a synthetic marijuana that is, comes in powder. Is that also called K2? Yeah, it's, yeah, well, K2, it's code, K2 is like a herbal thing that's coated in that, but you can get just the straight JWH-018. Yeah, I have heard of that. You know how, like, that Balco thing, they were doing steroids, and what they were doing was they were making a steroid that was not recognizable in the test because it was, like, one molecule different, or somehow or another, they were, they were engineering really? it. Well, they're doing right. the same thing with marijuana. They've made marijuana. You can smoke, and it has the exact same effects as marijuana, but it won't show up in a drug test. Really? Wow. Yeah. Have you ever Boy, tried it? No, out. no, I haven't. Well, Stealth. I live in California, and you know you That's can get right. pot everywhere there, and it's basically legal. They just put it on the ballot for November. It's going to be yeah. uh, legalization. It's going to be on the ballot. Wow. Are they going yeah. to just sell it and tax it? And fucking yeah, well, get that's the what they fucking should have uh, done a long the time ago. They zone it, though, right? You can't just buy it everywhere. They're well, like they, cigarettes. Yeah, they zone it now. I mean, they, they, supposedly they're supposed to shut down a lot of these uh, pot dispensaries because they're too close to schools and residences and all sorts of other things. Does that ever really fucking matter if things are close to a yeah, school? Yeah, maybe it does. I don't know. I don't mind. As long as it, I mean, as long as it's available somewhere. I don't I, mind. I just, yeah, you're right. It's just I some just, dumb law. Like, it, hmm. like, well, it can't be within such and such of a school. Like, who cares? I do. I wouldn't want my fucking kid going to kindergarten and some douchebags getting baked, like, right next door. Well, don't get baked next okay, door. kids. Buy you weed, weed, but, you know. The problem with pot is the problem with society in general, is 80% of the people are fucking retarded. <laughs> and if you get 80% of the people high, and then you go, oh, well, that's what potheads are like. But well, you can no, have a, no, that's, 80, that's retards high. That's, you can that's have a CBS happens. that says liquor, like, mm, near a school, can you? Yeah, no, oh, that's, that's a good point. point. What about good booze, point. man? man. <laughs>
man. <laughs> you know, man. I, I know they were trying in Nassau County to put some law on the books that there couldn't be a gun store uh, within a, uh, dist- a certain distance from a school or even school bus. And it's like a gun school store bus. isn't a pla- uh, school like bus stop. Uh, they were trying to get this uh, gun store shut down. And it's like, you don't buy a gun and then walk out of the gun store and just start, yeah, like, like shooting it up in the air like Yosemite yeah. Sam when you leave the place. Uh, it, it, that to me is just a cop out thing that politicians use too much. It can't be close to a school. Wow. Yeah, like, yeah, you're going to shoot you think about how many gun ranges there are and how many gun stores there are and how little crime occurs in these places. Yeah, yeah. You know? Not only that, that law is designed to stop people yeah. from buying yeah. a gun and then go shooting up a school. If you're going to shoot up yeah. a school, the distance anyway. from the gun store isn't going to stop you. Yeah, exactly. really make I can't it get all the way across town to yeah. do this. Yeah. It's ridiculous. And, and, and uh, ridiculous. strip clubs is another one. Uh, uh, now, you don't want a strip club right next door to the school, but when you say like a thousand yards from a school, and the strip clubs are just not open during school hours. Hours. You know, when the kids get out, maybe well, they can go in and see the, the town's not as good as the night. They get the day open. strippers. Yeah, they got the day Vegas. strippers. C-sections. Unless you're in Vegas. Yeah. In Vegas, it, we went to the Spearmint Rhino at 9.30 a.m. on a Thursday, and it was mobbed. Great, isn't really? it? It was mobbed. We had to wait yeah. to get seated. <laughs> wow. It was crazy. Couldn't believe it. Thursday morning. It was, thir- we were, it was so gross. We were driving there, and it was me and my friend Tate, and we were, we were in the, the, uh, the car, and like the fucking the, the hot sun is hitting the windshield, and I'm like, I should be asleep. This is so <laughs> what retarded. What am I doing? We're at a so job pathetic. somewhere. And when we got <laughs> there, <laughs> something industrious. <laughs> it's ridiculously packed. <laughs> Reading another theory about Muscalin. <laughs> You're making fun of him? Yeah. Why are you making uh, Yeah. Stuff? I don't. Joe this actually. some good talk. Sometimes you yeah. got to expand your brain and see maybe there's some other shit out there. Joe and Preston are like very to, well read. I don't think you'd like to see if there's uh, other shit out there, Vinny. No, I do like Jersey. to see other shit, but I don't, I, I <laughs> don't necessarily want Some it. of the shit might just be right. Listen. Who knows? There's I, a reason why they put blinders on a horse, okay? There's some <laughs> shit they don't need to see. Just keep moving, stupid. Get on the track. Straight. Oh. <laughs> Wow! Do you expand your mind? Right you know? <laughs> that was awesome. How to ponder that? Not, for a you know, no, uh, no, I don't. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Vinny's very different than Joe. Yeah, uh, yeah I'm amazed. Though. I like that. I, I like to think it's it's not just this horse shit that we're looking at every day. That there might be some different looks. There's out there. a lot more. Yeah, There's a lot. More. I like to think that. I like to think that too, but I don't necessarily want to dig into a pile of cow shit and eat something off of it to find out. You really have to. You ever get a friend who no. grows it in his closet? I don't even know the difference between mushrooms and acid and. Well, I don't know. I don't either, but... Well, there's a lot of differences. <laughs> Joe, what's the difference? Is, is a psychedel- LSD is a psychedelic, well, right? Well, there's a bunch of psychedelics that affect your brain in different ways. There's salvia, there's, you know, uh, the the cactus, <laughs> the mescaline. You know, there's a bunch of different things that have a bunch of different And effects. they're all different? They're all different, yeah. It's, the way people look at it is like, uh, the, the, you know, it's like you're visiting different neighborhoods. You know? And each one of them has a completely different feel, different vibe mm-hmm. to it. It's like it, drug you know? Epcot. Everyone else's neighborhood's got a different thing. Oh, I'll let that sit out there. Sorry. Wait, hold on. Uh, I'm doing well right up to that point. Oh, right up to that point. Everyone was. Right there, I stepped we up. We really point. haven't had any good bombs today. Wait, that's yeah. a good one. <laughs> you know, what, is it, what is it? Fucking drug Epcot. I didn't like that you put a B in Epcot. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Jim. So uh, I want to hear fucking Kenny be a DJ. Oh, you want to hear some of yeah. that? Uh, we we uh, are running out of show. On-